Hey YouTube, Jesus Freak with you once again. I'm out car shopping with my daughter and we're trying to decide which model we want. Which one do you like the most, honey? I like that one. That one? Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Wow. Uh, let's go check the odometer. I bet it has low miles. Let's see. Yep, low miles. Wow. I'll tell you what. Take your pick. Any one of these cars you want. I'll buy you two of them. I pick the green one over there. Oh, very good. Pontiac G6. I'm glad you didn't pick the Cadillac right there. <laughs> Why? Because that cost Daddy a fortune. I want the Cadillac. Yeah, just like a true, spoken like a true woman. Hey everybody, 2011 is the Lake County Fair. I'm here spending the day with my daughter again. Having a whole bunch of fun. I got the uh, tag so I can ride. She can ride unlimited rides all day. We both can. I'm gonna try to ride some of the rides and I'll share it with you all. Last year, a lot of you guys basically said, how come you're not riding with your daughter? To be honest with you, some of the rides like, you know, the uh, fever ball and such, they just spin and go upside down and I think in my old age, my equilibrium can't handle it, so I tend to get dizzy on some of these rides, whereas I used to not have that problem. So anyway, I'll ride as many as I can. Hope you're having a nice summer yourselves. God bless. Lake County Fair 2011, right? And last year, you guys griped and said, how come you're not riding? So guess what? We're riding. first-person perspective but this is kind of hard to hold the camera so if it jostles around I apologize say goodbye Stephanie goodbye hope I don't die we're just kidding she's not gonna die it's a safe ride you rode it before just a little while ago didn't you yes are you looking forward to riding it again yes <laughs> can you act any less enthused yes okay here we go Okay, remember the camera's rolling, so scream if you want. Here we go. Close your eyes if you get scared, honey. It's okay, honey. Oh, 
Keep your head in. You know why it was so different this time than last time? The people behind us were rocking it. You can make it rock and make it spin more. We didn't have it spinning as much last time. That one was way crazier. Would you ride it again? Yes. You would? Yes. <laughs> Just got now and take a break. Yeah, it would be later on. Wow, that was crazy. That you got... was awesome. What? That was awesome. Yeah, you gotta really hold on on this ride. Because I was coming off my seat and going forward. Yeah. I was, I was like, oh, please don't let me die. <laughs> okay, there you go, power surge. Do you like this better than power surge? No. No? I feel like my sandals are gonna fall off and hit somebody in the head. It'll be okay. I just won't wiggle my toes. <laughs> I didn't think about it. Hi everybody, we are riding the Matterhorn. Yep, here we go, we're getting ready to go. Get off of me, girl! <laughs> it's okay, you go say against me. Okay. You too, me stuff, I'm doing the Jesus Freak thing for my dad. We are on the Starship, so let's see how it goes. probably know I'm a millwright by trade. I fix machinery for a living. I don't work on carnival rides, but the interesting thing is machinery is machinery. As we can see here, it's a pretty simple unit. I could fix almost anything on this machine just by looking at it. Here we have some hydraulic cylinders that raise and lower the mast. Here we have a planetary gearbox with a coupling unit and a hydraulic motor. Hydraulic motors have a whole lot of torque. They really do a good job. Here we have a cylinder that just extract, or just retracted. That allows the system to rotate, as you can see with the um, gearbox spinning right there. It's a pretty simple setup. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a ring gear in here, uh, basically like a long, a round gear. I mean, it's actually pretty cool. Here we have the solenoids, you know, hydraulic pump reservoir and such. It provides the um, fluid motion to turn that motor. Electrical panel over here, some hydraulics for outriggers. This whole thing folds up. I mean, it's, it's pretty simple. Now up here we also have another hydraulic motor that will turn the unit. Oh 
you know, it's amazing. Once you know what you're doing, it's not very hard to fix things. It just takes a little bit of education and skill. Kind of like Christianity. When you first start off as a Christian, things seem very intimidating. You don't necessarily recognize all the stories of the Bible. You don't recognize all the things that other Christians are talking about. Maybe you're vaguely familiar with it, maybe you're not. But over time, with experience and practice, you learn and you become a stronger Christian. Just like being a millwright, a mechanic, a machinist. You don't start off with all the information. No one's an expert, it takes time. I've been repairing machinery for 15 years I've been uh, as a trade. I've been working with tools since I was a kid. So it's taken, a, so far, my entire life to get to the skill set, to the skill level that I have now. So those of you that are new as Christians, don't give up. Continue. Learn, learn, learn. Feed yourself. And eventually, you'll be able to look back and say, wow, I've learned a whole lot. I pray God blesses you all. Is he soft? Yes. What do you feel like? I want to feel him too. Oh, they're so warm. Their little bodies are so warm. They're just so cute. He reminds me of an Oreo with strawberry filling. Because he's okay. pink inside. Pink? Yes. Then black and black. They really make those too. Look at that one with the, like, the stripe on them. Yeah, very cute. It's sleeping bacon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's lots of bacon. I wouldn't disturb them if they're eating. Watch, let me see. Right there. I was petting lambs earlier, feeding see, them. Well, look at it, he just smelled my hand. Uh, Try it. He won't bite you. See it? Look, he's smelling me. And keep your hands balled up. So if they did nip your finger, they can't bite. Watch. Uh, they don't like oh me. no, he's doing good. They're just timid. There you go. See, look, they're very oh, curious. They're very curious. Just like I say, keep your hands like this. Not like you're gonna punch them, but that way they can't nip your fingers. He won't get you. Up, I, I, assure, I assure you. These are the not violent animals. Look at him. Look, <laughs> he thinks I've got food. He wants to eat. Come on. Oh, look how pretty these are, Stephanie. Oh, those are very pretty color. Cut in front of this gentleman, did you? Oh, they're just so cute. They're so sweet. Then they grow up into ugly things. Doesn't they the tasty? Oh, he's coming up close to the thing. Yeah, you're not escaping that thing, little dude. Look how cute. He's so tiny. are different kind of peacocks than we saw recently. You remember the video I showed you of the peacocks? Come 